Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's look is a twist on your traditional pinup with some glitter on our liner. I paired it with a dark lip for some extra drama. And um, yeah, if you'd like to see how I created this, keep watching. On my face, I'm wearing Mary Kay foundation all over, Cinema Secrets for a highlight, and the Zaran face definer to set the highlight and contour and mattifying powder everywhere else. My brows I filled in with Hagar and Esther's Brow Definer in Nubia. And first up on my lids is Primer, and this one is Violet Storm from Mary Kay. You can use any color because we're going to cover it up. Over my primer, I'm applying a cream base. This one is Trick from OCC. I'm applying it all over my eyelid and I'm blending it out towards my brow bone. The first eyeshadow is actually not an eyeshadow, but the highlighter shade from the Zaron Face Definer Palette. I'm applying this all over the eyelid. I actually apply just a little, and then I'm going to spread it all over the eyelid. It's very, very pigmented, so you actually don't need that much. I applied it all over my eyelid, and then I went a little above the eyelid towards the crease to create the illusion of bigger eyes. In the crease, I'm applying the contour shade from the same Face Definer Palette, and I'm using a tapered blending brush to do that. This one is the E35, I believe, from Sigma. And I'm going to apply it in the crease. And I like to build this, so I apply a little bit and then I go more and more just until I get the intensity that I want. With a clean brush, I blended out the outer edges of the crease color and then back with the tapered blending brush to pull down the contour shade down to meet the nose contour. You only need very little product for this. Now that I have the eyes the way I want them, I'm going to clean up the edges with the same highlight powder I used on my face. And then I'm going in with the liner, starting with the wing and pulling it in as I always do. I'm going for a pretty thick, dramatic wing. The size of your wing liner will depend on the size of your eye. So if you have more space, like I do, you can do a pretty thick line. But if you have smaller lids, then you want to go for a thinner line. Now I'm tapping on the glitter over the liner. I wet my brush with Lit Clearly Liquid Glitter Glue and dipped it in the glitter and I'm just patting it onto my winged liner. I used pretty bulky glitter for this because I want a dramatic look. If you wanted yours to look a little more subtle, use finer glitter. My lashes are number 138 from Amazing Shine and I'm applying them with black glue also from Amazing Shine and a pair of tweezers. I always secure the outer corner first then the inner corner and just push it up till it's perfect. On my waterline I'm applying the same gel eyeliner I have um, in my wing and it's Jazz from Zaron. Then with a smudger brush I'm going to smudge out my lower lash line in the same contour shade that it, that's in my crease. Then I'm going to go in with some black. This is Just Black from Magnolia Makeup. Mascara is the brand new voluminous mascara from Zaron. It has a huge brush but does great things for separating your lashes. On my lips, I'm wearing Flappa Velo Lips from Magnolia Makeup. It's a beautiful deep um, wine shade. I'm around to blush. My blush is Red River from Lila Lee. A bit of bronzer on my nose and we are done with this look. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please rate, comment, subscribe and share this video with your family and friends. Happy holidays.